hi everyone and welcome back to my channel today i am going to be sharing my on the go toddler snack essentials my toddler is 20 months old and she is the snack queen she loves snacks the only way sometimes to bribe her outside to be a little quiet and well behaved is to give her snacks so mama comes prepared with all the snacks so I thought that I would share it with you guys. We've tested a lot of snacks on the go So I kind of know what works and what doesn't work for her and Hopefully I can give you some ideas. Right, let's jump into this stuff I'm very excited to share with you guys the first very obvious thing that we are going to talk about is Cheerios my daughter loves Cheerios. This is one of her favorite things. Half the food pyramid is Cheerios and the other half is strawberries. So Cheerios are a must. But for on the go, we use these little munchkin snack grab and go things. We have several of these. We have about four of these around. I use them on the go. I keep them in the house with little snacks around. Cheerios. I don't know why this might be silly but this is my favorite on the go snack especially if you're on a long car trip and you know the little hunger is setting in I like these because my logic is there's a hole in the middle so I feel like it is probably like the most choking hazard friendly snack on the go so Cheerios are my favorite I wish everything came with a hole in the middle so I'd be a little bit less paranoid but let me show you because we have one in our bag yeah so i mean <laughs> like i said we went, like i said we went out yesterday so so this one's actually empty it needs a refill but these are great she loves this she learned how to use this really really young and these are great we put goldfish in here we put cheerios in here i do not put yogurt drops in here because she's a fiend and she'll just eat the whole cup so highly recommend these things are awesome and also i've noticed like when she throws them they don't tend to spill out so that's really nice so these are an essential they come in so many different colors if you have a boy if you have a girl if your favorite color is green they have all the colors so definitely get you some of these little snack cups those are great you could put anything inside of those i love that it is goldfish now for in the house i just buy the regular bag and do it that way for on the go they also do sell little bags pre-portioned out which are cute but when i find these i like to get these because they don't crunch and munch in your bag if you know what i mean they don't get squashed, they don't crack, they don't break, they just stay really nice inside of this container. They also stay fresh because this is obviously not, you know, one outing. The next thing we will talk about is any of these kind of little pre-packaged potato chips. These are my favorite, the veggie straws. Again, same logic, they kind of have a hole in them. So I like this, I'm a little less paranoid. So these veggie straws, I love these because they're good for her. They got the hole in the middle, feel safe about these. And I like these because I can eat them. So if I'm hungry, I share the snack with her. These are my favorite. You know, they have every kind of thing you could imagine like this. They have pretzels, but she's not good at chewing pretzels and really hard things like that so i try to stay away from that but if your child likes pretzels they even have those i've seen this with the cauliflower kind of pretzels and stuff like that so any pre-packaged thing is just great because you could throw it in your bag if you go outside and you don't use it it's still good you don't have to worry about it these are our favorite oh they have the pirates booty ones like this too but she can't have them they're too big i tried with her happy baby teethers there's you know every brand has these out she just happens to like this one sweet potato and banana there's also one this color that comes out maybe it's seasonal it's like pumpkin and something that one is her favorite one but these are great for on the go because you know you have to work for it also teething children i also like these in the house because i know you've probably seen a million people do it but you could put peanut butter on it or whatever kind of you know avocado and stuff like that so these are good these are just a staple in the household period okay so next thing for my snack queen here wrinkles 
crinkles. She loves the crinkles. And the ingredients are pretty decent. I mean, I kind of feel like she's eating a veggie in some way. These I used to get in the regular grocery store. And then, I don't know, they just like fell off the face of the earth with crinkles. And my kid is like, hello, I need some crinkles. So I hunted them down on Amazon. They were like about less than $3 for each bag. These are great. They also have the little resealable thing. Definitely lasts more than one trip outside. She likes both the flavors. I don't know if there's any more flavors than this. These are the only two I've ever come across, but these are great. I highly recommend these. I like these. I feel like she's eating something fun. I don't know, I like these for her. So, next thing we have here, I got the whole value pack of these suckers. Again, all the brands have them. They have like the Yogi Baby ones and all that, but the Gerber ones, they're her favorite. To me, they look the best from the other ones. We've had some questionable looking ones, but these are more like a freeze dried kind of texture. She loves these. These are like baby catnip. I try to bribe her to do all kinds of stuff using these yogurt drops. So, so you definitely get them. They're a lot cheaper if you buy them in the four pack because these are like a little expensive per package if you buy them loose. So these I do recommend buying in like a bulk kind of thing. I think I got this at Target for maybe less than ten dollars but each bag is around three dollars so it was a really good deal highly recommend yogurt drop next thing i'll talk about just to break up the whole snack 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 we'll talk about i bought this because it's warm outside now it's summer i don't want to be carrying a sippy cup of milk she likes to drink her milk out of this munchkin cup which has you know so I'll bring one of these and I'll bring this so I can pour this in here because if depending on your depending on where your little one is at, they might not really be able to just hold it and drink it out of the straw because you can squeeze this and then there's a milk volcano which you know nobody wants to pick that up. So I bought these. The reason behind buying this whole thing was because this was about like five dollars and something cents. One day we were out and about. We were out a little bit longer than I thought we would be. And so I went naturally to get Starbucks because I'm the caffeine queen. And I bought her one of these. One of these was like almost $3, which is crazy. So I bought this whole pack for like a couple bucks. But for on the go, these are awesome. They're shelf stable. You don't have to keep them in the refrigerator. I love these. This is something new that we're gonna try out. And I'll just always bring this, put it in here. Keep in mind, the reason I don't like to just put some milk in here and let it ride is because this is not spill proof. This is not even a little bit spill proof. But this one is her favorite cup. So this is what we put the milk in because I don't like to put the milk in. This next thing I'm gonna show you is this. By the way, these all come with like the handles. This is the pink handle, because I don't know what the purple one is. I took them off because I want her to hold the cup with her hands and she's really good at doing that. This I bought for on the go because first time mom, we were at like the park and I noticed all the kids had one of these. And I noticed even baby bottles come like this, which I never knew. So I said, why does everybody have that? Oh my gosh, because the water is gonna get so hot just sitting outside in the carriage. So I went and picked this one up. This is the Munchkin brand. I'll be honest with you, this does not keep it cold, not even a little bit. Yesterday we left for the park, I put the ice cubes in here, I put cold water. By the time we got to the park, the water inside of here was warm. So I do recommend getting one of these metal type of cups or bottles for your children. But I don't recommend this brand. Yeah, don't, don't buy this. This was like $15 and it does not keep it cold. So I don't recommend that. Okay, moving on to another big favorite around here, which is applesauce packages. Usually I don't buy it like this. I'll go to Sam's Club because you got like a million in there for maybe two more dollars than this, but we needed some of these. So these, I'm sure you know, these are the Go Go Squeeze. They have no added sugar in them, so I don't even feel bad. This one has two different kinds, which is apple and give me five. Look like this. 
these are great because i could just hand it to her she knows what to do with it she doesn't put it all over herself these are great she loves the applesauce pouches are a huge hit around here so definitely recommend these go go squeeze next up i got the idea to make this video because i was ordering some on the go snacks and i did place an order on amazon so i'll show you what i got on amazon i got a couple of these boxes oh my god it's falling apart <laughs> of like the food pouches amazon had these at a great price this was under nine dollars there are eight pouches in here so like a little bit over a dollar each but when you go buy these at the store they're like close to two dollars a piece so i thought this was great i love these things i know like the sucking is not the best because they don't practice the thing but they're for on the go so what's the harm um these i highly recommend i have several kinds in here i switch them up she eats all the flavors i do try to kind of stay away from the banana ones because you know gut health um but she loves these and this is a great way to get your children to eat all the veggies and all the fruits that they wouldn't normally eat this one for example carrots bananas mangoes and sweet potatoes after i said i try to stay away from the bananas but like she would not really eat any carrots if it wasn't for that this one is a morning one it's apple cinnamon yogurt oats and chia she loves these things and again there's like a beet one this one is pear raspberry carrot and butternut squash so these are great they have a little number on here in case you know i didn't know any of this stuff so i want to share this kind of stuff so somebody can hopefully you know save a headache so they have this little number over here and they have like all the ranges from you know six months and up or 12 months and up i always just make sure that it has the t for the toddler the ones for the younger age group are very watery make sure you give your child a bib when you give that to them because when she was little she used to wear the whole pouch now she's good with them because experience but i highly recommend these she loves all the flavors i had one that was like beet blackberry and i don't know what and she loved it she devoured it which is awesome because there is no way on god's green earth that i am going to get this child to eat a beet any other way but besides in these pouches so i highly recommend these the last thing that i grabbed from amazon was these this is cute how it came um i guess i have to open this it's from baby bellies these are little on the go things this one is like circles it's organic sweet corn roundabout this again we used to get in the grocery store and they disappeared like everything my poor girl really enjoys they kind of take off the market or something in the stores so i got these there's another one that's like banana puff corn or strawberry something she really likes those i picked this up from target the other day we needed something to kind of stash stuff in when we're out and about or going to like the park the water thing and you know all those places you go travel around so it looked really nice there's a lot of space in here it has a nice thick insulation type of deal i wanted a nice big one so i could keep not only her stuff in it but my stuff too and i also like to keep the dry snacks in here because if i throw them in the regular diaper bag sometimes they'll get squished besides the goldfish those are on point but they'll get kind of squished so i throw everything in here nice and big i like the pattern i thought it was fun with all of the fruit they had one with that was like white with cherries on it that was really cute too but the only one that they had left the zipper was broken so we naturally opted for the fruit party so we got this and then i just thought that i would pick these up these were like three dollars each in target but this way it wouldn't get squished or anything you can throw one of those oh i forgot okay so showing you that made me want to show you this which is of course i'm sure you've heard of them uncrustables but even these kind of things i like to throw in here so they don't get squished and mushed and all that kind of stuff these were three dollars this was cute for like a sandwich or any kind of stuff like that roll-ups wraps tortillas that kind of stuff 
and then this one just has two little compartments if you could see so I thought, you know, if I wanted to bring her like some fruit cut up or something like that, I could throw it right in here. Maybe even some yogurt, throw a spoon in the bag. So that would be awesome. The last thing is these, what are they called? Like ice packs. I don't like those blue square ones. I don't feel like they do a great job, especially in a big bag like that. I feel like those little blocks, I'm pointing because I have some in the freezer. But I feel like those little block ones, they do a better job in a smaller cooler. So for this big one, I got two of these. I did not get these at Target. I got these somewhere else. Target was all sold out of these ice packs. I thought these would be great. Obviously, stick them in the freezer. Please, people, don't give me a hard time. <laughs> stick them in the freezer. And then, as you can see, it fits like perfectly around the side so I figured I could just keep everything nice and protected in there for you know when we're running out and about and we might be out for a long time at the park and doing all that kind of fun stuff because honestly guys I'm learning all of this stuff this year because last year we didn't really go to many places there wasn't many places to go and there wasn't many people to see and there wasn't many things to do so this year i'm kind of learning all about the playground scene the park scene the water park scene the pool scene kitty pool learning all this kind of stuff that was everything i wanted to share for my on the go toddler snack essentials i hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video i enjoyed filming it like usual if you're still here, please like and subscribe. Leave me a comment, say hi, and I hope you have the best day ever. If you watch this video, you're obviously dealing with a toddler, so, you know, bless. And I hope that your toddler is not having tantrums and giving you a hard time because toddlers are dangerous. I completely understand that. I got a lot of injuries around here. So again, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for taking time out of your day to come to my channel and hang out with me. And I hope to see you guys back here soon. Have a great day. Bye. Now go survive your toddlers, people. Yeah, we're winners. Survivors. Behind the scenes of the mess I make to film a video how to hustle and clean this before my tiny boss wakes up she will not be pleased <laughs> bye guys yogurt drop addict